before the Eagle Ford Shell boom, Dilly was just a, you know, pretty much small, quiet town. You know, there was uh, it's a population of about approximately 3,600. When most of the changes have come about within the last year, we have seen a a lot more growth, a lot more people come into the city of Dilly. There's a lot more inquiries for economic development for the city of Dilly. Um, more hotels, more businesses coming out. The need isn't just what has, you know, the oil industry bringing the driving force. The need has been that there has been a need for additional housing. So this has been a plus for the city of Dilly because um, now with the Eagle Fruit Shell, we are able to bring and promote those kind of things here within the city. The biggest employer now at the, at the moment would have to probably be the, the oil uh, industry, you know, the different oil companies that are surrounding our area. With the changes that have come about with the city of Delhi, new businesses coming in, uh, there's a lot more jobs available in the area. So the businesses that are already existing have to be somewhat competitive. So it's to an advantage of those who are working in this area that uh, we are no longer uh, looking at just the minimum wage. We um, have to be competitive in order to be able to uh, have the workforce that we need, whether it's the small local businesses in, in town or whether it's us as a city to be able to um, have more people come work for us. As an overall organization for the city of Dilly, the mayor, city council, we are working towards those things that, you know, we are all engaging, you know, what is going on and welcoming the oil industry because um, in the long run, we want to see the, the city of Dilly grow. We want to have more businesses. We want to have more jobs. We want to have more opportunities for uh, individuals in a small town like this that, that hasn't had it before.